Hello, Gemini. Welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing a journal reading and this is for upcoming week. You and your current person. How do you feel about each other? What is going to happen next? Uh, the outcome and a lot of other messages surrounding whether this is a new love or going to be the same person. So you're going to check all of that, but keep this in your mind since this is a general message. Take what resonates and what does not. And for more accuracy, reach out to me for personal readings on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. The details are in the description box. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus signs. In Gemini, plus Ross watchers can watch this read. Okay. All right. The cards are a little thick. Your person's feelings towards you their next move how do they see you your feelings towards uh, them your next move towards this person how do you see them the outcome all right let's see what's coming in for you okay their feelings towards you is two of swords okay so their feelings right now is like maybe they do not want to connect you said something that may hurt her, that may have hurt them or they are writing and deleting messages wondering is this the right time for me to reach out or am i disturbing the gemini is this person going to respond or they're interested in me or not there's a lot of confusion in their head at one time they're like i want to talk to this gemini another time they're like no i don't think it's a good idea so they're also planning on calling or messaging you but there's a confusion in their head like is this the right move towards gemini or am i hurrying or the another thing when it comes to the feelings you know this person is not sure what they exactly feel about you at one point they really like talking to you they just want to get to know you more at another point they're like leave it i'm not interested so this person is confused about their feelings towards you may have more clarity why is there a confusion someone is in corporate job office job that requires computers it accounts uh king of pentacles this person is busy making money i feel like this is someone that is extremely dedicated towards their passion towards their life purpose they could be well off they could be rich or this person has big plans that they want to make something big out of their life so they don't have time for love this person has some major project going on where they are focusing all their energy into okay and all right two of cups and the five of pentacles okay this person is not sure whether they want another person in their life they're not sure that they want to be in a relationship in general it's not just about you with anyone else they're not sure they want to be in a relationship i feel like they have not prioritized love in their life okay uh, there's someone that has prioritized their career their life purpose too much and they feel like being in a relationship is like investing time and efforts money as well so is it a good idea for me should i go ahead should i go for it because all the things that this person has will be on the shared basis later on if they're in a relationship so they they're more you know comfortable not communicating um you know relating to love not having you know any responsibilities simply being alone focusing on work and growing in life that is what their current energy right now is but that doesn't mean they don't have a heart it's just that their mind is elsewhere and they're not prioritizing love in their life it somewhere comes in the end okay so they do think about you there's something that excites them but they are trying to avoid thinking about you falling in love with you by focusing on their money maybe they've recently gone through a lot of uh financial crisis or there was a downfall in money and 
now they have picked up and they're doing well so they don't want to lose focus okay so this is what i'm seeing but they do feel that there's something with you that they're trying to suppress they're trying to suppress their feelings in short okay so let's see their next move towards you the emperor you guys may be connected through work or they can make an excuse of reaching out to you um talking about work okay they are trying or they're pretending that they're not interested deep inside they do think about you a lot and try to avoid these thoughts so they're coming towards you there will be some communication where they are showing a power over you they're showing dominance okay they're like okay you you have to get this work done for me or can i get a favor from you you know like that so i feel like indirectly they want to maintain communication or some form of contact with you and i'm also seeing this person has ego here they could be an aries it could be older for some of you this person already has a kid for some of you okay let me see more to this three of pentacles you guys may be connected through work they may ask for a favor or they may uh tell you to do this work for them three of pentacles yes and this could be your senior as well but this person does see you as a capable employee if you're working under them or they will offer you to partnership with them okay uh they are trying to build a relationship with you around money so the intention is not to hold money from you intention is to contain you in their life to maintain you in their life in some way or form somewhere their heart is right now not ready to open up this is what i'm seeing so they want to make efforts towards you talking to you about work and i feel like there will be communication between uh three days or three weeks or there will be three day long communication between you and this person then they're talking about their work they're posting about oh how i uh reached this position how i made this money and they just want to tell everything about their you know success but the real reason is they want to maintain contact I'm also seeing this is possible that they can reach out to you only for work initially. Okay? At times they do miss you. Okay? So it's not like they're 100% interested in uh their work and not at all at you. They are interested but they're trying to suppress their feelings. How do they see you? 7 of cups. They're confused about you. Okay, they see you as someone that is different from them. you're also someone that is in their eyes is one of the options interested in them they don't know much about you they're not even thinking much around what uh your personality is okay we see seven of cups how do they see you seven of cups the moon okay one of the options that's for sure the nine of pentacles okay they have a lot of options they have a lot of options but when they see you they feel like you're the one that they picked you're the one like a prize for this person you're the one that they feel like oh you're so attractive this gemini is so one of a kind they're so different they also see you as an emotional person they see you as someone that has been deceived in the past and that is why you're so independent and um financially you know free and capable on your own they're attracted to you for sure currently they just want to see you i feel like they they have feelings but they're trying to suppress it so that they, they just want to see you as one of the options they don't want to open up their heart to you but they're very attracted to us you keep on watch keep a close watch on you okay secretly when they're about to go bed go to bed that's when they like check out their social media or your messages or whatever it is or your photo they keep looking at it and feel like wow this this gemini is so attractive but still they are treating you like an option right now okay how do you feel about this person nine of pentacles i'm not seeing you also have very strong feelings to them right now because it might be a, just a beginning you're you're trying to get to know about this person who is this person like what do they want 
and do they like me or not you have a lot of questions in your mind so you want you want to take it slow you, you're hesitating you're not in this rush because you don't want to spoil you know your energy by giving away your heart so you're in control of yourself I feel there is a financial connection between you guys or will be there is a financial connection so you currently are also seeing this as more of professional uh is more from a professional front they're also seeing this as more from professional front but they're also attracted towards you so you're a little resistant you're a little hesitant you're not sure about your feelings but yes you like it when this person pays attention to you so you want to explore you're interested in exploring more Knight of Pentacles, how do you feel about this person? Page of Cups, you do have a crush on them. But you're not in a rush, okay? You're keeping it to yourself. And you're not in love with this person, but you have a crush on this person. Okay? Like, there are lots of fishes in the sea, but this is the one that you like. Okay? But you're trying to maintain just um, a little communication. And that too, limited to the work or something official. Alright, this is what I'm seeing. Page of Cups energy. You want to explore this connection. You like this person. And see, you're, you're interested to know this person more. You want to talk beyond work. But you're not in this energy of reaching out to this person for the same at first place. But you're okay with this person comes towards you with some loving feelings. Okay. I'm feeling they have something, but they're trying to suppress this. Also because you're not giving them any hint. Or even if you give them a hint, they're still going to be like, um, shy talking about it or thinking about it or try to suppress this feeling but they're they're trying subconsciously they're trying their best to maintain communication through work okay and they see you as um, a reliable person when it comes to work this could be a cancer this could be an aries all right um well off successful but they also have this uh, thing going on in their mind that you could be uh, one of the options. You're one of the options, so you can also ditch them. Okay, so they haven't yet seen your heart, but they are interested in how you look right now. So it's an initial stage. How will you, um, will you make a move? Your next move, I mean. Seven of swords. You're scared of making a move towards this person. Okay, why? I'm also seeing that one thing I can see over here when this uh, this has to be clarified this person also feels that you want to say something to this person but you're hiding it okay they feel like your bank of secrets they feel like you have something going on in your head that you want to say to this person but you're keeping it to yourself what is that that's what they're thinking so they're confused okay let's clarify this eight of pentacles in reverse i'll take it as reverse okay so what i'm seeing is eight of pentacles is in reverse is that you're scared of taking action you're scared of making efforts and also because this might be work related okay why seven of cups you think that this person may have other people interested in them you feel like this person is always surrounded by people and you also feel like uh you're not sure whether this person already has someone in in their life so you're like no i don't want to mess it up okay i don't want to look, look stupid because there are other people involved i'm also seeing that you uh feel that if you reach out to this person what if other people at work come to know and they make fun of you okay what if they tell other people at work what if they tell your colleagues what if people come to know if you have mutual friends in case you have mutual friends another th reason why you're not reaching out to this person because you think that they have a lot of lovers and they see you as an option i feel like you got that right intuitively that they see you as an option right now so that is why i don't want to make efforts you want this person to treat you exclusively how do you see this person wow you see this person is very lucky this could be an Aquarius, someone that is lucky, someone that has it all, someone that has um, a lot of people's attention and a lot of people want to date, very attractive, one of a kind, 
uh, you want to have a new beginning with this person. There's something special you feel for them, but you're you're keeping it to yourself. You have little sweet um, heart pounding for this person. You st still have some feelings that you want to explore, but you're not going to cross the line. This is what you're thinking. Yes, two of wands. Okay. You do contemplate talking to this person more than um, official, you know, way. I feel you're trying to maintain a healthy boundary, okay? Because somewhere, you also do not want to be treated as an option. You feel like this person is going to end up treating you like an option, play with your heart. So you also have to protect your heart. You're trying to protect your heart. You do want communication. You see this person as someone that will treat you like an option, in short. Okay, what is the most probable outcome? Okay, let me just confirm this most probable outcome, whether this was upright or whether this was reversed, because I didn't want to take it as a reversed. So there must be a reason behind it. This could be a cancer, strong cancer. I feel like your person is emotional. That is why they're trying to control their feelings. Um, very emotional energy that I'm seeing. Six of swords. Yeah. Queen of pentacles. There is a chance with this person. There is a chance with this person. The chariot. Things can move ahead between you guys. Okay. But there will be hardships. It's not easy with this person. They're not easy to tackle, understand, adjust with. But if you make this person open up in love, there's no one better than this person that can love you. Okay, if you do this. So this will uh, take time. I feel it's going to be a challenge for you. I'm also seeing you rising in terms of your money. I'm seeing your position is rising. Your money is rising. You're becoming more and more financially independent, capable, strong, solid. You will see this person as someone that is on the same page as you. Both of you are well off. Okay. I'm seeing that you're trying to or separate yourself from this person and you have gotten inspired in some way or form by this person and you want to focus on your money you want to focus on your life purpose you want to make a lot of money okay you want to grow so i'm seeing you right now focusing on how do i become more successful more rich and i feel within six months of time you will be at this stage where this person is right now or you're already at this stage so there you go, it's happening. But I'm seeing you making a difference in your finances. A lot of growth is happening, financial independence. There will be a big smile and confidence on you, on your face. I'm seeing you're breaking away from this person for a while. I feel like this is a very stagnant relationship. This is going to move slowly, but it is definitely moving ahead. I'm not seeing that you guys will cut off forever. I'm seeing this connection will grow in six months from now. But you will be taking a break from this person because they're not taking any action towards you. So you're like, okay, let me heal my heart, focus on myself and that's it, I'm done. So out of nowhere, this person will reach out to you on their own because they know deep inside that you had something for them and they were suppressing their feelings. So they will be coming towards you the completely different energy because they'll be proud of you that you are so independent and you made a name and uh, respect for yourself. You have a recognition of yourself and this person sees you as someone that is on the same page. And now they have undying respect and love towards you. Love, seeing you with the loving eyes, but there is a need for a temporary separation between the two of you. Let me pull an advice. They are going to watch you with loving eyes in the near future. They will try to work this connection out. Not now. Later on. If you start doing things for yourself. If you start doing things for yourself. If you follow your passion. If you follow your uh, life purpose. I'm seeing there's no, no one that, that can stop you from being successful. Nine of Cups energy. You're going to make it big. Trust me. There's a new beginning coming into your life okay you will stand out i feel you've started to leave everything and focus all your energy towards your life purpose your work and this person will look at you and like wow 
you did it and you belong to me so that's how the changes are going to take place i'm saying this is what your uh, major goal and focus should be like when you take a break from this person you will see this person's energy changing towards you completely and wanting to end up being with you now that is when you will have a decision to make whether you want to go with this person or not so it's 50 50 it depends upon the future how you're going to see this person whether someone new came in or you're going to give them a second chance or well, first chance in love okay this person may not be ready right now i'm seeing that you've met in the wrong time okay king of cups this person could be a scorpio pisces cancer but i feel like this is someone that will hold on to you if you push them away they'll still hold on to you that's how they'll fall in love with you so that's about it i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful race thank you for your time gemini do like share comment and subscribe come back for more i'll see you back again bye